a scene Holly Wells never expected to see when she picked up her daughter from a school dance Friday night. She was crying. She was very visibly upset. There was several, probably 10 to 12 girls that I saw crying between the time that I arrived at the school to pick her up and when we were leaving. According to several students, they say a staff member had acted inappropriately towards them. In an email obtained by Local 5 News, Kaleidoscope Academy officials saying in part, quote, we completed our investigation into the situation alongside the family, Appleton Police Department, and district leadership and found the claim was not substantiated. We spoke to Appleton Police Monday and they told Local 5 News that they've reviewed a school district video of the incident and that's how they concluded the claim was not substantiated. Nonetheless, a group of about 40 students organized a walkout Monday morning. This was something for me to stand up for myself and for other girls. Quincy Villanueva says the students organized the walkout on Snapchat. They are not letting us back in this school. They have locked some of the doors. Some of them are barricaded by teachers and other staff members. Throughout the day, there were Appleton police cars here at the school. There was also a fire truck as well as an ambulance. Parents telling us the school district didn't notify them about the incident until Monday, adding they had to reach out to the district to find out information about the alleged incident before then. The lack of transparency surrounding the incident is really, I think, the frustration from the parent side of things. Never once got an email this weekend. I'm a little bit perplexed right now, actually, that they couldn't even reach out and let us know that there was an incident. Kaleidoscope Academy did send an email to parents around noon on Monday, addressing both the walkout and the incident Friday. Part of the email read, quote, during the school day, there was a small group of students who left the school building to protest. Administration worked with these individual students and families. Student services staff are on site at Kaleidoscope Academy to assist students as needed, end quote. At least one parent of a student who participated in the walkout said the school district did not work with the parents at all. In Appleton, Paul Stino, Local 5 News. Local 5